What's up, YouTube? How's everybody doing today? Good, good, cool. As you can see, I'm getting ready to give Woody an exam. <laughs> Actually, we're going to do some uh, Bondo or body filler on the bug. Um, I'm just stirring it up right now and then we'll mix it up and slap it on there and do some sanding. If you could, uh, subscribe, not comment. Well, you can comment, but subscribe down at the bottom and uh, we'll get right to it. I'm not a body man. I had to watch other people do this. So, so take what I'm doing with a grain of salt, basically. Just want to make sure it's all mixed up consistently. You only got like maybe five minutes before this stuff flashes off. Okay, bring it back in a minute. Put out here with us. And uh, we got some uh, Bondo slung on. It's actually a U pole lightweight gold. I know nothing about body work, so we, Me we're, we're going to make it happen. <laughs> we're but trying. we're just waiting for it to harden up so we can sand it. I'll bring you back. Okay, so it's been about 10 minutes. I'm going to hit it with the electric sander and then I'll come back and block it just to knock some of this stuff off easier for me. We'll time lapse this.
This is taking it off way better. <laughs> Grippy. <Yeah. laughs> Shit. Broke it. Okay, so, so far, sorry, I'm trying to switch my camera around. We had to go get some different sandpaper. We got some uh, 40 grit, so it works way better than the 80 grit. So we're gonna start at 40, go to 80, 120, 180, 220, 320, and that should be good for paint. But um, we sprayed it, we sanded it, we sprayed it with a, it's called guide coat kind of like just black paint and then you sand it and wherever it shows up darker wherever it shows up darker I don't know if the camera can catch that that's your low spots but it's just called guide coat it's kind of like a light black spray paint you could probably use spray paint I don't know it would probably been cheaper but uh that's where we're at I'm gonna mix up some more uh, putty fill in these low spots and then go from there We got Woody doing some Bondo. It's a learning experience for us both. But you can see the low spots. There's the low spot over here. Over here. Over here. Anything that looks like black is low. I'm talking to the camera, not you, obviously. I know. <laughs> I'm just going right away with it. I'm gonna have to get another gallon. <laughs> yeah, this door is pretty, pretty messed up from that uh, sandblasting. I believe he heated it up too much. Uh, yeah, that's what it seems like. Because there wasn't any bondo in it when it was sandblasted, not that I know of. It was just that front end that was bonded all the crazy right here. should I'm specify body roll. filler instead of Bondo. Yeah, this is just, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just trying. Okay, hit the spot. A little bit. We gotta sand it all again anyways. Yeah. That 40 grit takes it off like butter. Quick. Yeah, it's pretty quick. Yeah, it's I put a little too much harder in this, so hopefully it still works. Should still work. Yeah, it just hardened faster, is all. Oh! Yeah, so did you just ruin board. my board? I didn't ruin your board. <laughs> your board's not ruined, son. Don't get worried. I don't ruin things too much. I make things harder for you, that's all. <laughs> all right? Yeah. I try. I try my best. I'll remember. All right, we'll bring you back. This is the guide coat process. This I just got at my local paint store. They sell it at like Eastwood is a good store that I like to use. Yeah, I should have probably sanded this on before I put this on, but it'll give us an idea of where we need to go.
All right, we're still sanding, but uh, we're gonna chalk this video up. Yeah, tell him what I did on this while yeah, I'll bring it in. What he's been working on the inside as I was working on the outside. So, um, hold on, let's look at this real quick. That's pretty smooth, but I just started sanding again. There's a really low spot right here, so that's gonna have to be fixed. But the rest is, the rest is getting there. There's a low spot right here also, but it's getting there. Let's go see what this guy's. Hold on. And Woody over there. What's up? He's been working on this. Yeah, it's about ready to hit with paper. Because this was caved in. I don't know if you if you haven't seen my previous videos. I heated it up around the outside. And then I hit it with a duster, which cools it down super quick. And it popped out some, probably about half of what it was. So it's not too bad now. Yeah, it's not it's not too shabby. I got a little high spot in the middle here, so a little bit right there, but I'll bring it down. Yeah, it's way better than it was. Way better. It's not real thick either. It's not. No, it would probably be an eighth inch, maybe. Yeah, maybe just maybe a sixteenth, something like that. Somewhere around there. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, say bye. Bye. Oh, then you want to say hi oh, to yeah, somebody? I wanted to have, say hello to Emmett, my grandson. He's been watching the videos. Be home soon, bud. Papa loves you. Papa loves you. What's up? Mad Styles here. Um, we're finishing up the body work. We didn't record for the past few days just because repetitive body work is not going to be fun for anybody to watch. So. <laughs> We're going to show you the progress. I'm just adding this to the end of the video that's going up in the morning. So here's the door. What do you hold on? So here's the door. It's got one low spot right there. It's got this done. Up here is done. Uh, let me switch the camera view so I can see. Right here, it's good. It's good. Good. This door was so wavy. It was like my butt. <laughs> worse than your butt. It was worse than my butt. And we're getting this. This needs, it's got some low spots, but this was that panel that we patched in. So we got to fix those low spots. Then uh, we're working on the hood right now. About to make some more body filler. Just about there. We'll yeah. A little bit more. Woody has had these fenders on and off more times than I can count. This is probably the best panel on the car right here. Doesn't require anything but some sanding. But uh, we'll get that done. And then uh, we're going to let it cure for probably a week, week and a half. Just to make sure if there's any shrinkage or anything. You can see the fenders are done. Yeah. Looking good. All the panels are hung up. I'm going to fire up the furnace so it warms up in here because it's like 50 degrees in here right now and we need it at least 60. He's only his own after today. Yeah. Roll he out. goes home tomorrow. Say Roll bye. Out. Bye everybody. He lives in Ohio so it's not an easy journey. <laughs> but anyways, if you could like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Truly appreciate all the support and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Maybe a tool restoration. Maybe. Hello. <laughs> Later. Peace.